Hello, I'm Scott Brown. Welcome to Green Wind and Other Home Energies. We're looking at a drawing that came from Carlos Arguelia in PDF form. I switched it to Bitmap and put it in the Windows Movie Maker. He told me I could use it, seeing as I was going to draw one of myself, but never found the time. We're looking at uh, nine coils, numbered consecutively in a clockwise order. The red coils at 1, 4, and 7 are Phase 1. The green coils at 2, 5, and 8 are Phase 2, and the blue coils at 3, 6, and 9 are Phase 3. Okay, to continue on, we need to find out where the starts are and where the finishes are. On a coil, the start is the first wire that enters the coil and gets laid down, and the finish is the last winding and continuation of the wire. On a stator, the same thing. When you got a set of three coils, you wind up with a start and a finish for those three coils. We need to find the starts and the finishes of each set. Okay, in the upper right hand corner you'll notice we have the beginnings or the starts where one, two, and three which are the first coils of all three sets. Uh, we take the start wire from those and we take those up to the terminals at the top for the starts. And in the same fashion we do the same thing. In the upper left hand corner we're taking the last winding of each of those three coils for those three sets and taking them up to the finished terminals. Uh, the red coil at number seven, that's the last winding on that uh, coil and that goes to the finished terminal of phase one. Same thing on the green and the same thing on the blue which is phase three. Okay now you can see all the connections. We're looking at the start going up to the terminal on the beginning side there for coil one in the red. The last winding of that coil in position one goes to the start winding of coil number four. The last winding of coil four goes to the start of the coil in position number seven. And of course the last winding of that coil in number seven, which is the third coil of phase three, goes up to the terminal block for the ending or the finish. And the same thing happens with the green and the blue. The blue kind of has just the words running across on the inside, but uh, all the connections are there and you can see how they're all wound in series from start to finish, start to finish, start to finish, all the way on the finish block. All three phases are set up the same. For wiring this in the star, you need to connect all the three starts or the beginnings on those terminals. You short those out or run a wire all the way across those and your power output comes out on the three terminals at the endings or finishes. And that's the way we wire up for three phase star on three phase alternators. Uh, I'm Scott Brown with Green Wind and other home energies. Uh, the weather's getting better and I'm um, just getting over a cold and we're going to resume the dual permanent magnet rotor axial flux wind turbine and the ceiling fan class videos before I transfer on to something else that I know you'll enjoy. I'm Scott Brown, Green Wind and other home energies. Many good things to you and yours.